What's up guys, it's me here, and you are in for an awesome, awesome card show recap. Um, there's not much to say about this card show besides that it, it was it was absolutely incredible. I mean, I met, it was a small show, but I met some awesome people that I'm still keeping in touch with. Some uh, people that I usually see at the card show, and I grabbed a bunch of bunch of nice stuff, uh, which I'm going to show you guys shortly. But, um, there's a reason I'm not showing everything that I grabbed, because it's just too much stuff. Honestly, like... I'm gonna shift the camera over uh, in a few seconds, but basically, I um, I got I grabbed a huge lot of cards from somebody from like the late '90s or mid '90s to 2000s to like a few years back. So that, that those are the ranges. I, I haven't got gotten a chance to get through everything. I'm probably gonna do a stream on it. There's no way I would show it on this video. The video would be way way too long, especially with the amount of stuff I'm showing right now. But um. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm I'm gonna give you guys a brief glimpse of it. I'm gonna cover up the camera for a second, just so you guys don't have to see all the other junk in my room. But uh, here it is. Again, sorry about the uh, uh, covering it up, but this is an entire shoe box of looks like there's some Bowman in there, all basketball stuff. Um, there might be some racing, but I'm gonna take those off. Uh, apologies about the feet, by the way. Uh, then there's a couple boxes over there. Hopefully you guys can see that. You got like it's a mess in my room. That's some stuff over there and there. Again, sorry about that. But I'm gonna put the camera. Um, it, it's a mess. So I there, there's a few boxes of, of cards to get through. Um, some of the boxes you might have seen are, are ones I already have, but it, it again it's a mess. So anyway, I'm gonna get through the stuff that I usually. Uh, go through, um, or not, yeah, just the usual single cards. Oh, by the way, I have business cards now, so I might be sending these in my packages soon, so this is what they look like, <laughs> nice gloss finish. I usually just share my email, but there's my number, and then Instagram, Reddit, uh, and then YouTube. Again, uh, email would probably be the best way, but I'm just gonna leave that right there, so I have to cover the, uh, Ingram, but I brought out the Kobe and the Ingram, uh, because... I usually bring out bigger cards for bigger mail, uh, bigger videos. It's already been two minutes and thirty seconds, so again, I'm bombarded with videos right now. I have to do a mail day video soon. That's long overdue. Excalibur pack and a complete pack rip. So, yeah, pre pretty busy as far as that goes. Anyway, here's mail day. I'm just, just gonna get right into it. Uh, price tags are still on some of these cards, so again, don't mind the prices. I <laughs> I don't have time to take all these out and make the video, um, but we're gonna start off with my. Uh, it's one of my favorite guys that I get to see at the card show. Again, the price tags don't really matter. Um, they, some of the stuff was discounted, but uh, he yeah he gives me some awesome awesome deals. So we got a Wendell Carter, Luminance, Zach Levine, Silver, Gafford. I usually don't buy this uh, collegiate stuff, but he actually had a pretty good deal on it. Uh, and and it's Gafford. This I brought from somebody else, but it was the only card I bought from that person. It's a uh, Eric Gordon out of twenty five, and it's pretty nice. Um, ooh, this one's pretty good, too. Uh, it is a Jamal Murray. I'm trying to take this out, because the... Sorry, the top loaders are really tight on some of these cards. But it is my first Jamal Murray hit, I think. Um, probably should have switched the top loader. Because, again, the top loader is kind of scratched up a little bit. I'm trying to... And the sticker thing. Okay, there we go. Uh... Don't mind the sticker, I peeled it off in the card, but, um, Jamal Murray, Rookie Remembrance, that one's actually really nice. Uh, he had a good playoff run. So, let's see. Let's get that and put that there. Uh, oh, before I get to the others, I kind of want to show, actually I'll just save those till later. I'm, I'm just going to go through singles right now. Stephen Curry, this one was from, uh, one of my other regular guys who comes. Oh, and I was a dealer at the show, by the way. I didn't sell much, that's one of the... <laughs> Not so great things about the show, but it is what it is. Uh, yeah, Steph Curry, old school Ewing, I'm collecting that set. Another MVPs, uh, or MVP Harden, MVP uh, Wilt. Get Hyped Mitchell for the Get Hyped set collection. Move the camera back a little bit. This one is nice, Curry uh, Prism, that I believe is 1415. Yep, 1415. Yeah, 1415 Curry Prism, base. Uh, those uh, earlier Prism stuff is actually pretty sought after. Wendell Elite Base. Oh, yeah, it's Elite. Um, Westbrook Splash. Giannis Get Hyped. 
uh, Court Kings Press Proof of Curry. This one was a good one for the PC. This one is out of 99. 79 out of 99. No, 73 out of 99. Sorry. Come on, focus. Yeah. Uh, then we got a Steve. So this is a, so I, I this is a good price on the Steve Kerr. It was on card with the relic, but then I found it had a ding on there. So that was kind of that kind of sucks. So always look at the cards before you guys buy it. I guess one of my um, one of my words of wisdom. And it's Wednesday today. I mean, I, I might the video might come out today. Depending on that, it might make sense. What is a Wisdom Wednesday? Uh, Justice Winslow Prism Base. Gafford. Kyrie Prism. Chris Dunn. Uh, Wendell. Studio Rookie. Uh, th oh, these two are pretty good too. Uh, from the same product. It's a Select Luka Base. And a Select LeBron Base. Um, yeah. Then a Giannis Superstar. Insert. This one is a die cut. Really, really nice card, especially with the dazzle look. One of my favorite inserts from Contenders. Uh, Chandler Hutchinson, red. It goes nice with the jersey. I'm I'm not a big Chandler Hutchinson fan. Out of 149, by the way. Um, since I don't know if, if he'll fit in with the uh, with the um, what's it called? What's it? I mean, we have a lot of good players like Levine. I, it, it would be, it's gonna be hard for him to get some spotlight, in my opinion. Matisse Thibel, this is Panini Player of the Day, rookie. Zach Levine, this is the uh, absolute. Um, this is the thicker stocks. It's hobby. And then two really nice Zach Levine cards. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say these Zach Levine still the end. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give you a hint. It, it, they are from Opulence and Dominion. So I'm gonna save those, not till the end end, but they're probably my two, one of my two favorite pickups. Uh, ooh, this one's good too. Uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but these select cards are going for a good amount. Uh, this one is a Kobe. Rest in peace. Um, this is the first year of select as well. I have a Wade of the same kind. But I'm really, really happy I could get a Kobe. And a, uh, Luka Dominance. This one is, this one was probably my hardest one. I think I need the LeBron too, um, for the Dominance set. Another nice one, that Savage of Giannis. I think he's, yeah, he's blocking semi all the way. Uh, there's a that Savage of uh, Levine too. I'm gonna try to get that one, but this is a silver. I know it's not showing in the light as much. It's getting a little dark outside. Uh, another nice one here, Bill Russell. This is Black Friday, I believe. Yep, out of 25, my first ever Bill Russell numbered card. And it looks really nice too with the uh, shimmer. All right, this one's good. I'm gonna save this one till the end. I got another Giannis card that you guys will really like, in my opinion. Uh, this one is a Daniel Gafford hit, Prism Sensational Signatures Auto for uh, for the Bulls PC. And then, uh, let's see this one. Oh yeah, I'm trying to dig it out. Um, I, I don't. I normally don't get Hall of Fame autos unless they're like Bulls or something like that. I couldn't pass up on this one though. Uh, since it's kind of rare to find his auto, it's not super rare, uh, but Elgin Baylor, and this one is out of only 15. So, 9 out of 15, all-time grades from Elite. Uh, yeah, 13, 14 Elite. Elgin Baylor. And he, and he signs his full signature, so that's cool. Uh, another nice one. This, this is from my guy, uh, so, at this card show, there's basically... <laughs> let me give you guys a rundown of... It'll be brief, um, since I know we still have a little bit more stuff to get through. But, we basically have my my regular guy from Wisconsin, who who has a lot to prism, and he has new stuff, generally. Uh, and he gives me great deals. And then we have another guy, who is... He, he's, he's the... He, I, in my, I like to call him the king of the show. Uh, he's not, he doesn't run the show, but he, man, this guy has baseball, football, and basketball in, from low end to hot, like, high, high end. Uh, it's crazy what he has, so. He usually gives good deals, too. Then we have this guy, which I'm about to show. Uh, this is a Jordan and Pippen 3D triple-double standout. Um, I don't have the Jordan yet, so that's kind of cool. So, yeah, he, he specializes in older basketball, uh, older baseball, older football. So, same thing with this, uh, team set from, this is 
Skybox, yeah. 9394 Skybox. Chicago Bulls team set. Really, really cool. Jordan on the front. Oops. Ah, pile's falling over. Then I got this Kobe from Two Million Dollar Moments, and I know this set is with that guy I was telling you about when I bought it, uh, his stuff in bulk. So I might add that one as well. Bulls 87-88 pocket schedule. I'm collecting these pocket schedules, so if you guys have any for cheap, let me know. I, uh, I highly doubt that any of you watching would, but I just thought I'd put it out there. Uh, here's some more present day inserts. My House Tatum. My House Trey. And I, I'm pretty sure you guys can tell by now I'm insanely happy at what I got. I mean, I came out of this card show um, thinking... Hold on, close that for a second. Battery's running well. But I came out of the card show thinking, like this was, it, it was just awesome. But at the same time, I mean, it was like, it was, it was like when you eat 50 donuts. That's how happy I was. Not that I eat 50 donuts, obviously, but. Yeah, uh, NBA Jam Session. This one is, yeah, con oh, Connection. Connection Collection. Ooh, that's a mouthful. Uh, these are the, obviously, the more vertical cards. Same thing for my, my older guy. Um, these are the Sprint scoreboard. These are like credit cards, kind of. The call, calling card, call cards. I'm, I'm, like, I'm gonna take these out. I know I didn't show you guys the team sets, but I, I'm pretty sure you know what some of that looks like. These I actually didn't take out. Uh, but we got a Jason Kidd. These are, these are pretty cool. Yinkadir. I never really heard of him. Jalen Rose. That's a familiar uh, face. Nice. Uh, he had a decent run with the Bulls, I think. Glenn, Ro uh, Glenn Robinson, Eric Montross, and a Daniel Marshall. So, hold on. Yeah, Daniel Marshall. These are like... Calling... Um, see what it says. Yeah, so... Yeah, just just cards. Uh, expires 1995. That's cool. So there's all oh, there. Okay, so it says the mintage on these. 48,000 in the world. Which is actually quite a bit. <laughs> I was wondering, I'm like, man, these these look pretty cool and they're super cheap too, so no wonder. 40,000, 48,000 cards in existence. Makes sense. Um, what else? Oh, here's another set. This is, this is the entire, I, I highly, oh no, this is a McDonald's set. Sweet, I completely forgot about that. Um, this is the Upper Deck McDonald's set. This Jordan was the first ever card I got. I got it from my uncle. Uh, I cherish this card really, really well. Still have it to this day. This is the entire McDonald's set, which is, as I said, is pretty cool since I've kind of always meant to, to go after. I mean, the cards look, uh, they, obviously they don't look anything spectacular, but I mean, it was the first set I got exposed to. First product is Threads, by the way, if anybody's wondering. First product ever, 15, 16 Threads. Got a Tim Duncan. Uh, oh no, got a Draymond Green die cut out of that, by the way. Another set. This one is the USA Basketball. Nine Jordan cards. Uh, the, I, I'm guessing it's the entire set. I mean, unless he just wrote set just because there's a lot of cards in there. You kind of get what that is. Uh, Alright, so these I'm going to have to shuffle through really, really quickly. I'm going to move some of this stuff out of the way. And the reason I'm doing that is because the Wisconsin guy that I was telling you about, he made me a really, really, really good deal on these uh, contenders draft or these Prism draft pick cards. And there's some Prism stuff in here, like regular Prism, but normally, as I said, I don't go for Prism draft picks. But he gave me a deal I couldn't really refuse, so I was like, ah, I'll just take the entire lot. So there's a lot of these in here. The sleeved one should be better than the non-sleeved. So here, here goes. Alright, we got a Schofield, Jordan Poole, uh, Jerome. Some of these I'm going to flip through and, um, let I me mean, know that, like, you generally, all these should be available. No Zion or John here, though. Just letting you guys know. But, I'm, I, you know, honestly, oh, there's, uh, yeah, Dwayne Dedman, John Collins, Horton Tully. My bad. Sorry, Bobo. And Ingram. Um, but... Yeah, so, let's see what else. So, I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't have anything against Prism Draft Pick stuff. It's just that, I mean, the, well, I mean, you guys can tell by the amount of cards I'm showing. It's made in 
pretty, pretty big quantity. Uh, yeah, Cavalinga. Um, Brantley, Johnson. Uh, no notable players yet. Um, there was a Kobe and an RJ Barrett, which I actually traded for that Luka Dominance that you guys saw not too long ago uh, in this video. Um, some of these players I actually haven't heard of until now. I mean, obviously we have the notable ones like uh, Jordan Poole and then yeah, Grant Williams right there. Langford, Alexander Walker. Uh, there we go, Dwayne Bacon, Johnson. So again, obviously yeah, there's not going to be any Kobe and... Like, I mean, the Kobe's were, uh, were inserts, so worth about as much as just regular base stuff. Uh, but man, again, not saying the names because me saying Cam Johnson, Cameron Johnson 50 times is not going to be too exciting for you guys. Alright, here's some sleeve stuff. I'm going to, actually, a little bit of more non-sleeve before I get to sleeve. Sorry if this is a bit boring, but, I mean, I th again, if anybody... If any of you like this, uh, oh, there's Porter Jr. If any of you like these contender draft or prism draft pick stuff, definitely let me know. Got a lot of Kevin Porter Juniors, Dylan Windler, Alexander Walker. So th these are some of the better players. Uh, better players, as in out of the pile, I got not counting Zion, Ja, Kobe, Rui, Tyler Hero, uh, Thibault, things like that. Alright, now sleeve stuff. This should be better. Some of it doesn't make any sense, like a Langford for four bucks. But Culver, that's decent. Oh, and I still have to get to the uh, really, really good stuff. My bad. Uh, I'm gonna go through this as quickly as possible. Jaron Jackson, that one's, that one's cool. I didn't even know that was in there. KPJ. Um, Pashal. And Garland. Um... I'm hoping for some colored parallels soon. I know I saw some, just didn't see who the players were. Oh, there we go. Romeo Langford, Blue Crusade. RJ All-American. Jackson Hayes. PJ Washington, Silver Crusade. Sounds cool. Uh, Crusade. Um, what else? News. Oh, the mail day's long overdue, by the way. Grant Williams, Silver. And, oh, there's a Rui. Uh, yeah, long, long over the mail day, coming up soon, but should be pretty sick. Okay, I really, really do apologize. One more, one more, uh, stack. I hope you guys are at least liking that there's some parallels and things like that in here. I'm gonna give away a lot of these cards, by the way. Not in this video, video, but in some other video. Since, I mean, you, you guys might like these, like, PJ, Rui, nice Langford, Chuma, Nasir Little, Dominance. Drummond, I might mess up that one to the side. I don't know if I have that one. Clark, Jonathan, Isaac, Green, Williams. And again, I don't even know what some of these cards are. It's not like I'm flipping through knowing what the cards are. Like, I had no idea that was in there. <laughs> Claxton, another Rui. Bible, there we go. Jackson Hayes, Gafford. Another Pashal. I'm hoping I didn't give away all the Kobe stuff. Uh, there's Chandler Hutchinson. Another Rui. Oh, so there's... Oh, okay, I forgot. There's, like, variations. That's why I was wondering. I'm like, man, I keep seeing the same player with, like, different pictures. Rui. Grady. Uh, oh, there we go. That one's a good one. Pink Pulsar Gafford. Um, that's Gafford. No, uh, Nick Claxton. I think that's silver. Another... Cam Johnson. Blue. Um, Clarks. He's... Jeez, there's a lot of Crusades. Hey, there's a Kobe. Uh, glad there's one in there at least. Two, two Kobe's. Oh, dang, are there more actually? Nah, it's three. Okay, three for now. Um, RJ, DeAndre Hunter, Jarrell Brantley, and I don't know, the Bobo. Cream on Water, Silver. Edwards, Pink Pulsar of Nikhil Alexander Walker, Blue of Jackson Hayes, Carson Edwards, and a Partridge. No, I'm just kidding. Missy the Little. <laughs> um, Alright. Jeez, this 20 minutes? Yeah, almost 20 minutes. Okay, I, I do apologize for uh, taking s so much of this time. But, I'm, again, I'm going to split the other cards into a different video. I also forgot about this. I got these Jordan cards. I'm not going to show all of them, but nice little Jordan 
a lot from uh, the guy who sold me the other Jordan stuff. Got a USA Basketball, some of the classic Jordan base. Uh, another page. Oh, this one's of um, a little older. Uh, got Hakeem the Dream and Magic Johnson. And then David Robinson and Rodman. Pretty cool stuff. Okay, enough of that. Let's get on to the big cards. Or uh, the three, m my favorite cards, I should say. Uh, so first one is my first ever Giannis hit. Yes, that's right. Giannis, I finally got a Giannis hit. Not an auto, but it's a second year dunk company relic. Nice, nice white on uh, white jer with the jersey. Game worn, I hope. Yeah, game worn, Giannis relic. So that's that's staying in the PC. Other two cards, even better. Uh, the first one is a Zach Levine City of Gold on card auto from this year's Opulence too, uh, and this one's out of seventy nine. Oh, I forgot to show one card actually. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find it first, but. And we got a Zach Levine on card. This one's out of 25, so it's kind of a little better. It's got a little bit of edge wear, and there's like a little stain that's bothering me over there, but Relic, uh, red, red jersey, which I usually rarely ever get to get, yeah, get to get those red, um, red jerseys. So I'll see if I can find the, the darn card. Uh, should be around here. Unless it's not, then I, then I must have lost it. Um, or put it in the mail day pile, which I probably ended up doing. Uh, yeah, okay, you know what? Um, I have no idea where it went, which is interesting. I'll find it later, you know, I don't want to waste you guys' time, but it was a, it was a nice Fred Van Vliet card for the PC. Um, starting a Fred Van Vliet PC, so that should be interesting. Uh, I don't think it's around here. Yeah, alright, I don't see it. Um, okay, that's fine. You know what? Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, an awesome card show, in my opinion. Uh, and I'll try to find that other Fred Van Bleep card soon. Thank you.